Hey guys, what's going on? Happy freaking New Year, you guys. Oh my god, has 2020 already brought some of some of the saddest news? I mean, if you really take a second back, what's happening in Australia and the fires with the animals and the people, it's so sad. I say love your neighbor, love yourself, do for others, be kind. Learn how to love. Learn how to open your heart. I know for me personally, um, my astrology sign is a Scorpio, and I know that a lot of the things that are going to happen this year are going to be big things. And from what I understand, if they are correct and following astrology, a lot of these things are going to be good things. But it's not going to be an easy road, I know. And with all good things comes its rewards, but also comes its discipline and its responsibility. And I'm not quite sure what direction I'm supposed to take, but of course, following my heart and my brain, it will guide me. It always has. I'm so thankful to be in the position that I am in, and I hope you guys can kind of look inward and understand that, you know, we are a yin and a yang, and we are great, and we are bad. And we have all kinds of in-betweens. So today, we're going to sip on a little bit of tea, you guys. And let's get right into... So we're going to jump right into it. And basically what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be going over just a little bit of how I deal with, you know, taking some time away. Stepping away from everything. Stepping away from your work, your responsibilities, your job, you know, your friends, your family, anything... And everything that stops you from having your peace within, anything that might um, get in the way of you really just having a humble experience here on earth. We are so special to even have the 80 plus years that we get to have here. I say all the time, we come from nothing and we leave with nothing. And it's up to us to figure out how we can keep our balance and keep our love and I want my energy when I leave here to be on a positive. I don't want to have negativity flowing through my body and through my veins and through my spirit. When I pass on, I want to, excuse me, when I pass on, I want to have such a great positive energy that I get to share on to the world to make this world ultimately a better involved place, you know. I don't know if that's going to be the way that everything breaks down. I don't know if that's the way that everything is going to happen. I know solely for me, this has been my journey, and I love astrology, and I love following nature and science and the stars and the animals and also people. So let's go into my room, and we will do a three-minute meditation just about how to get back and heal oneself. And then I'll come back out here and we can chat one last time before I let this go. Meet me up in my room. Okay, you guys. We're here in my room. I'm going to light the candle. I want you guys, as I'm lighting the candle, just to go ahead and start getting some deep breaths in. You know, this is only going to be three minutes, so we're not going to have a long time with each other. But any time you can spend... Meditating, getting back to your center, is worth it. So I have set a three-minute meditation. And five, four, three, two, one. A mindfulness meditation. During this meditation... We will focus on being mindful, finding that point where you are completely aware of the now. Breathe in through the nose to a count of four, and out to the count of six. Whatever thoughts come and go in your mind at this point, simply observe them as if from a distance. See them as coloured balloons, as separate from you, and let them go. 
Let them float away. You are present now. You are not controlled by your thoughts. You can acknowledge that they are simply that. Thoughts. Be conscious of the beat of blood within you. Of the rhythm of your breathing. The brush of clothing against your skin. surface on which you sit, and how your body presses into it. Be aware of any scents that you can smell, or colours you can see. Notice the detail in the sound you are hearing. temperature of the space you are in. Spend some moments simply being. Being aware of all that is within you and around you right now, in this very moment. This is what it is to be mindful. Okay, so, as I close up, welcome to your meditation. So do that. Let's get back out in the living room. Always, 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 when I'm done meditating, I feel a sense of relief, and it's almost as if I was on vacation for three minutes. Coming back in too, here we are back into my living room. I will say, because I was trying to get across to the point of healing ourselves and learning to love more and leaving this world with positive energy so that when we're gone, we're passing it on to our earth, our mother earth. I took a different little approach on it and I went for mindfulness because I feel like mindfulness is very easy for people to understand what that really means um, as it was explained in the meditation um, to get yourself to a place where your thoughts are not running current in your head that those are just balloons and they're passing but what's most important is feeling what we have on our blood and the touch of our clothes and so on and so forth. You guys listen to the meditation as well. I want to say that if you like this kind of thing and you want me to make more content on meditation or even elaborate more into astrology, numerology, tarot readings, things of that nature, um, I am more than willing to go into that route. Um, I really haven't played too much into it. Sometimes I'm a skeptic. Sometimes I, there's no way I cannot believe what I hear because so many things have come to light as being a Scorpio and going with the astrology signs and and looking more into it and being aware of what they are, they're saying. Um, you have to work for everything and anything especially whenever it comes to advancing your life, your happiness. So I say shoot for the stars because that's where the answers are, baby. And until next time, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Leave a comment down below. Maybe you could subscribe. Till next time, guys. Bye.